Welcome to the Bob Lockwood Summer Festival of Stars. We got a long, long show lined up for you. A lot of exciting talent, trick riders, a lot of stars in the country field. And what all I want you to do is kind of sit back and enjoy the sunshine, because we'll get some of that today, and some fine country picking and licking. And ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce right now the Staten Island Naughty Posse. The Mounted Posse, the Sheriff's Mounted Posse of Richmond County. And I'd like to say that they're the official escort of Governor Rockefeller when he visits Staten Island. Would you post the colors, please? The Richmond County Posse, yes, ladies and gentlemen. Carrying the color of Cheryl Borden, Sis Moore, Anna Delshenko, Pat Miller. Anna Delshenko, Pat Miller, Carolyn Borden. Borden, and Sis Moore. And now, ladies and gentlemen, our national anthem. I'd like to bring to our microphones now the assistant borough president of Staten Island, assistant to Robert Connors. Let's make welcome Tom Loftus. <clears throat> uh, thank you very much, Bob. The borough president, of course, would be here, except that uh, we at Borough Hall needed a vacation, and we talked him into taking two weeks at the uh, Cape Cod. I want to congratulate on behalf of the borough president, Bob Lockwood, Carmen Montanti, and Art Center for the tremendous job they've done to, put, to get this show together. A tremendous collection of country, country music stars and artists. Now, I hope that this is going to be an annual affair. I think it might be even more often, but in connection with this, first country music festival, the Bur Borough President has sought fit to issue the following proclamation, and I'd like to read it. Whereas country music has long been a standard melodic background throughout the United States, and whereas the City of New York and the, the Borough of Richmond has always been associated with country living in action, whereas through the use of country music, country singers, and rodeo activity, America is best known for his outdoor life, and whereas a summer festival of country music stars will bring to the borough of Richmond an evening of typical American life. Now therefore I, Kermit J. Consells, acting borough president, by virtue of the power and authority vested in me by the city and state of New York, do hereby proclaim this day, Sunday, July 23rd, 1967, as summer festival and country music stars today. I hope we can read that every year, and uh, I hope we have more of these even during the year. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Loftus. And now with our March tempo, we'll post the colors. We'd like to give a nice applause to 
Staten Island's greatest, the Mounted Posse. Thank you, fellas. Organized and helped to promote the Summer Festival of Stars, Carmen Montanti. Thank you, thank you. We're now going to have a little bit of trick and fancy riding. The trick and fancy riding is going to be done by George Boardman, Margaret McIntyre, Sheridan, and 12 year old Arlene Davis. Come on, take it away, George. <laughs> George! Holly! Holly! George, come on! Ladies and gentlemen, George! You're wrong! my brother now to back to Bob Lockwood once again. Okay, thank you, Carmen. Thank you, Trick Riders. Yeah, where were they? What happened to the horse? And now let's uh, let's get the show on the road. Let's welcome our our house band, one of our great house bands, Eddie Rabbit and Walter Conklin, Chet Parks and Rosalie Allen's band. Right now, it's the Carrot Kids and Eddie Rabbit. I'd like to say good evening and uh, good afternoon, rather. I get so hung up with these evenings. Just so nice to be here in Staten Island this afternoon playing for you. I'm glad to see that there's so many people in this area that dig country music. So we're going to take up a few minutes of your time here and hope you enjoy what we're going to do for you. We'll get my lead guitar player, Barney, here on the lead guitar and do a little song about some stuff that's brewed down there in Kentucky and Georgia in the back hills. I can't reach that mic. 
called White Lightning. Well, in North Carolina, way back in the hills, my old grandpappy, he I had him a still. He drew the white lightning till the sun went down. He felt him a mug, then he passed it around. Mighty, mighty please, and your pappy's corn squeezing. She's gone! White Lightning! It's a little cooler up there than it is up here. Boy, it's a hot one out. I feel like a sauna bath up here. Let's do one right now. Uh, a song that was done by the number one country singer for the last couple of years. And uh, it's a song about love, and we hope it lives here. Oh, the sun's gonna shine.
live here Love's gonna live here again No more loneliness Only happiness Love's gonna live here again I said now Love's gonna live here again Okay, Eddie Rabbit and the Carrot Kids are going to have Eddie back in just a moment. But I want to make an announcement right now that if you have any children from the age of, uh, like, two weeks old to, uh, oh, maybe make it about uh, eight or nine, when you get some time, spare time, walk all the way down the fence, all the way down yonder, and the free rides for the kids. You bring right over to the, the old whip down there. You bring your kids up here, the free rides for the kids. Okay, here's a song that's uh, currently way high on WJRZ charts. And here's the guy who's responsible for the song. He wrote it. And Bobby Lewis sings it. Eddie Rabbit. And love me and make it all better. Love me and make it all better. Come back and ease the pain. Kiss away. These burning tears Say you love me again I was wrong Accusing you Of unfaithfulness 